Hey guys, EMC Shipping here for my first tutorial in two years. Same ship, but uh, yeah. So today we're restarting the uh, ECS Ocean or redoing it after years, two years. I've got a new design obviously, so on the fly around. Much better, <laughs> much more detailed, and I've got World Edit now, so it, it's a beautiful ship if you ask me. Personally, I don't take credit credit as due, um, but I think it looks pretty good. I think it looks pretty damn good. So yeah, I've got my notes next to me. Made notes for all five parts. This is a five-part series, so whether you like it or not, suck it up, buttercup. So yeah, we're gonna make the keel. And the keel is two hundred and ten blocks. And the height is, if you're building in the water, put do it 10 blocks under the surface because the height of the giraffe, the red section, is 11 blocks. So, well, to be honest, I could just go like in the line and I could just go like this. So, I'd probably start at about. Yeah, so that can be my Oceanic and this could be my ACS Atlantic. 190. Let's see. That's probably a bit far away. 229. It's about there. 214. 210. Perfect. Okay, and I'll just go see it. Red underscore T. Boom. Bop. Alright. I love World Edit. Um, makes my life so much more simple. Um. Mm. So, we're going to do the bow floor. So, we're now going to do the floor platings. And we're going to start with the bow. And what you want to do is you want to go to the six blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then you're going to go four, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five, six, five, six. Oh no, sorry, wrong, seven. And then you're going to go eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like eight. And then uh nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh ten, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Sorry, I forgot to say it's eleven after ten, and then it's twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then add two like that on top. Okay, that's the floor for plating, and now what you're gonna do is get a sign. You don't have to do this, but I just pers personal life improvement. You're gonna add signs with the section numbers. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I've seen another guy do these tutorials. Eight. Uh, I decided to like just build my own. See how it goes, and that was the result. And it looks fucking beautiful, if you ask me. That propeller design, by the way, you don't have to do that. I just did that because I'm, I'm really good at propellers. All right, so now we got those. And what I'm gonna do for the stern is I'm just gonna label every second section. I'm gonna do that for now. Can't be bothered. I've already labeled them. So we're gonna for the stern. We're gonna start on the fourth block back. So here, and you're gonna go. Four, five, six. What is that? Five. Yeah. And then it's seven, eight, nine, ten. And then so yeah, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know if that was ten actually. Yeah, that's nine probably. And I got that. That. All right, and then you've got to do a 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then again, you put the plus 2. So, yeah, now what you want to do is you want to connect them up. So, yeah, I'm just going to connect these two edges. This is the floor. Like, this is literally the floor. Um. Oh, what am I doing? Set red terror. I actually learned that you can just click on it today, so that's pretty handy. Uh, 
do a red. Uh, oh, oopies. Oh, before we move on, I'm just going to check out my upload. Okay, yeah, it's processing HD, so. Yeah, I'll put on extra security tomorrow. Okay. Um, okay, so we're just going to label the sections again. There's nine sections, so we'll just go zero. Actually, I probably don't even need zero, because that's obvious. Two, four. So I just like to label every second. Makes it a bit easier. Don't have to label every single one. I don't know why I did that before. Ah, uh, that's nine. Obviously. So now we're going to start with the bow. Like the bow sections. We're going to build that hole. That hole part, you know? Okay. So for section zero, I can see it goes. Okay, so three. Three. So three rows of three. And then two rows of two. And then up two. And up four. It's a pretty basic design. The bow. And then it gets a bit complex over there from memory okay because I did the scrapped a few things and it's the same as zero, uh, section zero for this one so three rows of three up two rows of two up two up four all right and then for number two it is three uh, three rows of two 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 up three one two three and up four one two three four yeah, that seems to be working so far. Okay, and then it's uh for number three it is three, two, three, two, two, up four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. Up five, yeah, sorry. What to say. It looks a bit clunky at the start, but you can see it gets more curvier over there. Uh okay, so four, three, two, two, uh up five, one, two, three, four, five, and then up four, two, three, four. It's a pretty small ship, so this shouldn't take long. So yeah, that was section four. Now section five is three, two, three, two rows of two, two, one, two, up four, two, three, four, and then up four again, two, two, three, four. So as you can see, you can kind of see that if you go like here, you can see that bulking shape starting to take out. So this is going to turn into that eventually, according to my notes. So yeah, well, some things we will have to look at the prototype because I just do not know how to write it down. Okay, for number six, it is two rows of three, one, two, three, and then two rows of two, one, two, one, two. Sorry, it's 11 p.m. at night. I don't know why I'm doing it now, but I didn't think it'll take long. I'll, I'll do part two tomorrow. So two rows of two there. All right, so three. What are we up to? Six. Okay, up four. One, two, three, four. Up to three. Two, three. Alright. It's not too hard to build a ship if you're building your own. You just need some shipping experience. And I've built the Titanic, Olympic, Britannic, Queen Mary, Queen Elizabeth. I've built, I've built all of them. Not on this PC. I just got this new PC recently with a 3060 Ti and the i7 12th gen. And my old PC and i3 and the Radeon RX 570 series, the one I made the I'm back video on. And then that old thing, I was on my mum's laptop <laughs> when I made the UCS Oceanic originally, so I'm going to rebuild it after this. Tutorials upload and done and all that. Well, I'm going to just build it on this map. Okay, so for the number seven, sorry for chit chat. Four, two, three, four, three, two, three, two rows of two, one, two, one, two, up three, one, two, three, up four, one, two, three, four. Yep, if it matches up, that means it works. Well, I think so. Number eight. Four, uh, two rows of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So small, like you have to do them small, you know. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, three, two, three. Two rows of two. One, two. We're up to eight, eh? Two, yeah. Up three, two, three, and up three again. Three. Okay, now for number nine. Yeah, you can see the, like, bounce taking shape. One, two, three. Oh, number nine is six. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then five. One, two, three, four, five, and then three. One, two, three, and then two. Two rows of two, I mean. And then uh, up two. One, two, and up three. One, two, three. All right, now to fill in the gaps, so I'll do a jump cut. So back in a moment. 
Alright guys, we're back, and uh, so yeah, um, if you don't know what I mean by filling in the gaps, you just go in here and just place, like, fill that in from up here, like on this thing, you know? Um, yeah, it's 11 blocks high by the way, if you're wondering. Uh, so yeah, I already said this at the beginning. Um, we're on to the stern now, uh, as you can see, I think I'm very proud of the little stern design I did today. Very happy with it. It's probably the best turn I've ever done, that's kind of sad. But yeah, it doesn't take long to fill in the gaps because it's just tiny shit. Well, I think it's like around half the length of the Titanic in real life. So, so for section 0 at the stern, you want to go up 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. No, I don't trust my counting. Yeah, okay, so it's 11. Good. Because it live box I you know. Okay, number 1 is... Two uh up eight one two three four five six seven eight and then it's up two uh okay so number two sorry tired uh same as one so two up eight two three five six seven eight and then two, and then there's a one up there, so that's all. You, so that's what's different. The three. It's okay. It's the same again. So you just want to go two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we'll go up eight. So uh, and then it's up two, and then that one again. And for four, it is okay. Two rows of two. Up seven. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, and then it's up two, and then one. All right. So yeah, it's like kind of a skeleton shape right now, but you can see it like over there. So yeah, I made that a bit high, then I, I mean low, but who cares? Okay, so no, wait, we're up to, we're up to number five. Okay. Uh, two rows of two again, and then it's uh, up six. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then it's up two, up two again, and then one. Yep, that looks about right. Um, yeah, that looks about right. Yeah, okay. Um, okay, so what are we up to? Six. Sorry, I'm just really tired. As I keep saying, three rows of two, two, two. Uh, up five, one, two, three, four, five, up two, and up two again, and then one. And I did not, my recording did not freeze just then, there was just my body having an uh moment. Alright. Uh, oh, what are we up to? Eight, no, seven. Okay, so three, one, two, three, and then it's three rows of two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And then it's up four, one, two, three, four, and then it's up two, up two again, and then one. Okay, well, we're up to eight, so it's going to be four, one, two, three, four, three, one, two, two, three, two rows of two, one, two, one, two, up four, one, two, three, four, up two, one, two, up two again, two, and then two that way, like that. All right. And then for number nine, it's going to be five, one, two, three, four, five, three, one, two, three, two rows of two, two, one, two, and then up three, one, two, three, up two, two, up two again, and then two like that. All right, and now we're going to fill in the gaps, and I'm going to do it with you guys, because otherwise this video won't be long enough. Um... So yeah, we'll just chitter shatter. I've been playing Fortnite a lot this last two years. Um, that's why I've been uploading and also kind of just fell out a lot of like Minecraft and ship building and stuff in that time period. And I got older, things changed. Went to a new school, got new friends, didn't move or anything. Just, you know, intermediate school. Uh, new computers, new interests and stuff. And just, yeah, and then I just like saw the old account, saw that it had like had some traction. Saw the old oceanic design, knew a lot more things about it because I came back to Sheffield this year. 
and I was just like, Ugh, I need to change that. And I know I said I'd come back a year ago, because that's when I saw I was gaining some traction. I'm just like, okay, why not? And yeah, now we're in. It's December the 12th, 2022. Well, 50 minutes away from the 13th in my time. You can check my country on my accounts profile. You don't. I don't really need to tell you it, but I am. It's New Zealand. If you, specifically Auckland, but I'm not saying we're in Auckland. That's too detailed. Because Auckland's pretty big. Well, not really compared to the rest of the world. Alright, almost done here. Um. So, yeah, and then, boom, one section two filling. That's the stern done, and now what we need to do, so I'm going to destroy these signs while we add it here, and then what you want to do is you just want to, well you you just want to fill up this ball basically, from there to there, just want to fill up the wall, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this square so it works properly and doesn't be all screwy around with my ship, which I'm going to call this the Atlantic and that the Oceanic, but this is the Oceanic tutorial, isn't it? So, and then we're going to go like that. I've got World Editor, and if you don't, well then, hard luck. You've got the long work to do, but I used to have to do the long work, especially when I first built the Titanic for a class project on Minecraft in 2020. No one believes me. Uh, see, like, like, watch this tutorial on YouTube, which was Rich Roosters, and people are just like, yeah, you stole them, like, bro, I spent, like, 10 hours building it, like, come on. Uh, so yeah, then we're gonna go search, word. God, I hated the intermediate school. Don't mind high school, it's alright. Okay, so now we got, now we got the wall, and... Yeah, and if you want, you can fill in the floor, which I'm going to do. I like filling in the floors, mainly for the fact that it literally takes probably 30 seconds at max if you are like, if you don't know what you're doing with World Edit. It doesn't take a genius to figure it out. Just got to go sit in here. And just got to go fill red T, and then just put in a random giant number. I'm just going to hold down the 9 key. Oh, tells you the blocks that's being filled. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go behind the ship. Jeez. I started filming this like 12 minutes ago. Alright, so we're just going to go like here. So we've got like half the, sh the hole done, which I'm going to do the other half right now. With a little tool called World Edit. So yeah. Nope, I better hurry up. So we're gonna go copy, flip, right, paste. Okay, boom, just like that. And that is part one of this new oceanic tutorial done. If you need to do the other side, you can just watch the tutorial again. Otherwise, I'll see you in part two tomorrow. Bye bye.